So, hey guys, for another video. I guess it's been eight months since I last up uploaded for YouTube. And now I'm here, uh, talking into this black screen. If I take a video of myself right now, it's taking a lot of my storage. So, yes. Sorry about that. Anyway, life update. I am so burnt out and left out. Though, right now, I'm in a new school. I'm still adjusting to myself. Though, my classmates have already a strong friend group. But I still feel left out because I don't even understand what they are talking about. And I don't want to interrupt their conversation because it's just too disrespectful to interrupt someone's conversation anyway back way back let's go back to um 2020 or something yes 2020 is around that pandemic time around december i it was the first instance of my uh mental health being so badly in mental health or something i don't know what the term is then 2021 i have playing genshin impact for like three years then i met a lot of a lot of good friends a lot along the way and right now they're offline doing their academics or something else that I miss them so much. To be honest, I don't have anyone to talk to right now. Though my family is here, but I don't want to address my problems because they don't even understand Though I already opened up, but I just don't know what to do anymore. Anyways, um, so during that pandemic days around 2023, or let, let, let me guess, 2022, yes, around 2022, um, Read then, yeah. that was last year. <laughs> Around grade ten, we we the um elementary students are still in the same class, but some in the new school where I am on. But during that grade ten year, it's like a fifty fifty for me because. There's a lot of good stuff that happened and half of it is just the most bad things happened during that class of the year. Though I do love the um food on the high the previous school I I'm in. Man, I missed the freaking dessert. And also, I enjoyed most of the time, though that wasn't that much because I am in depressed mode during that year. Also, someone has liked me, but I am depressed. So yes, sorry about that. And... I know I talked about this one like last year that I nearly freaking slapped someone because they disrespected me so much. So yeah. Anyway, moving on. I I am in a new school, new environment, but I'm still adjusting. 
Though I met uh, already um, so many friends, but not that close. Which that is my problem right now. I. So yes, you can say to me that I have friends, but I fe- felt left out because there's nothing left I can talk about except for academics. But most of the people is just so bored or uninterested about academics. But in certain situations or some academic event, they do, do tend to story about that, but it's just a fucking activity. And nothing else. After that, what did, what are you gonna talk about right now? Anyways, during the school, on my new school, I already um, showed my talents to my class though they appreciated it but i still hate that i set a one boundary about that i hate being in the spotlight too much which i kind of regretted over the years though i though sometimes i do like in the spotlight but not too much okay it's not like i hate the spotlight in all of the like the whole of it but too much I, I don't want yes there is certain spotlights for me but I don't want it too much okay plus and right now I did already ask my Cousins, what are the requirements for college? And geez, the standards for the admissions is high. Though grade 11 is the most stressful thing to me. Though in the first grading, my grades are kind of like a joke to me. Because the scores on my certain on the certain subjects I have is so low, like how the hell I get that freaking grades, and I kind of fail on getting the grades I wanted for college admissions, which. My cousins literally pressured me to um do something about that, which I did, but in the end, I kind of failed, but there is still some chances for me, I guess. And right now, I am so burned out. There's literally no one talking to me, like, there's literally no one. It's so crazy that you're so alone on your problems and ambitions that no one even interested in, which is kind of true most of the part. Like, there's, there's so, if Get this, if you and me, like, like between people, is so far gap, that's what I'm talking about. The gap between you and me is so far away that there's literally nothing else I can do. Most of the part. Because the differences is too huge. We have different interests. And me being left out, I already 
know how it feels to be ignored or left out. Though I already open up about this problem on my classmates, but some give me advice and one certain person literally invalidated me and not and not be able to fully explain my own problems because yeah i'm just looking for validation to this at at, at this time i just don't know what to do anymore like i kept, i've kept my si silence to just to protect people and literally um i i don't want to get involved in some kind of dramas in a friend group because i don't want to get involved and i don't even know what they're talking about Plus, people do intend to not let you join in their conversations because it's only for their close friends or something. And that's literally it. I have no one to talk to. Plus, we have different interests. And I, I'm still adjusting to, to this new life. And right now, I'm so burned out. Like, I'm trying to find my word on the efforts. I, my self-word on academics. But most of my life just go through this cycle of gonna wake up. Then literally do academics for like 8 hours or getting ready for school, then go home and sleep again and again. Like, in the past first quarter of grade 11, I have made so many mistakes that my efforts was not that right. Like the scores say otherwise. No one literally helped me but other than myself. I mean, yes, mostly of the people I have is just so busy on their academics that probably or somewhat suffering as well though probably they have friends to help them out which is yeah for me i always have helped them but for me no one is literally helping me it is hard to take on academics alone. It is just hard. I am still adjusting. And I, I don't even care about this stuff anymore because it tires me out so much. Like, I put so much effort and this it is what I get. And to be honest, I do not think I deserve this, um, or probably, it might change my mind.